years, people living in the south and west ends of Louisville have said that there are too many liquor stores and places selling beer in the area, and they say Family Dollar was trying to add to the problem. Today, Louisville Metro Alcohol Beverage Control announced that they denied 13 applications from Family Dollar. Wave News reporter Marissa Burke joins us now to explain why. Myra John, these are 13 pages of why the Alcohol Beverage Control denied Family Dollar's liquor license request. The denial is based in Kentucky law and regulations, but it also includes the public's reactions, crime reports in the area, and that Family Dollar is behind in paying their taxes. A five-year battle between Family Dollar and Louisville residents may finally be over. Since 2018, the discount retailer has requested liquor licenses in areas saturated with other liquor stores. So when the first sign appeared on Dollar Store, they started working. We started organizing how we were going to do this because it was obviously they disrespected our community. A letter went out Tuesday to Family Dollar Incorporated saying, based on Kentucky statutes and regulations, the Louisville Metro Alcohol Beverage Control Director, Brad Severia, denied all 13 liquor license requests. In the denial letter, some of the reasons Severia cites include violations of Kentucky laws, previous application history and impacts more liquor stores could have in Councilwoman Donna Purvis in Tammy Hawkins districts. The neighborhood that they represent need access to groceries and a lot less access to alcohol. The denial letter also explains Family Dollar is behind in paying $3,600 in taxes, which is a violation of Louisville Metro code ordinances. Crime reports around the Family Dollar stores are also listed as a concern. The denial letter cites more than 3,600 incident reports filed with LMPD near the 13 locations from January of 2023 to the present. We don't see anything healthy coming out of the sale of liquor, and I feel like these business entities are profiting off of people's pain. The public outcry against the liquor license request grew over the years, but on Tuesday, some residents feel like they were finally heard. This is our community, our choice, and our voice, and they use that power to stop Family Dollar from selling any type of alcohol product in their store because that's what they wanted in their community. ABC director Brad Severia hopes today's announcement is the end of this back and forth with Family Dollar and liquor license requests. Previously, Family Dollar said they would respect the decision by Kentucky's alcohol beverage control person, but that decision actually falls on Louisville's ABC director. They haven't responded to me about the Louisville denial. Marissa Burke, Wave News.